In today's video, we're going to style what I think is the most wearable trend for fall 2022. My name is Teresa. I'm so glad that you stopped by. Now let's get started. Now, full disclosure, I am not really drawn to most of the fall 2022 trends this season. I do have one of the fall 2022 trends that I am here for, and that is the Western style boot. I am so excited about this one. Something else that I really like about this particular trend is that I can style it with everything that I already own in my closet, and you can too. We're going to style several different pair of Western style boots. I have some various affordable options, a couple that are luxe, and I'm going to show you how I would style this current trend. The first pair of Western inspired boots that I have to share with you also happen to be the least expensive. These are from Walmart. Before I forget, I will link everything that I talk about in this video in the description box below, along with any of the clothing pieces that I showed during the try-ons that are still available online. But I digress. These are by Time and True. They're called the Western Slouch Boots. They are under $25. I love that these are so affordable, and I have to tell you that these are comfortable as well. I'm really pleased with these. These come in sizes 6 through 11. They are available in two colors. I have both of them to share with you. The first pair that I'm showing you is the cognac. They also have one that's called white, but I do want to point out it is not an optic white. I would call it more of an off-white or a shell. These feature pull-on styling with side pull tabs. They have a comfortable slouchy design. The leg lengthening pointed toe is so flattering. These also have a cushioned memory foam insole with a sturdy two and a half inch block heel and non-skid soles. When I started styling all of the boots in this video, I quickly realized that there were just so many outfit ideas that I could come up with. You can wear these with leggings. You can wear them with skinny jeans. You can wear them with boot cut jeans that are very on trend. They also look adorable with a dress. I also found that every one of these western inspired boots went with all of the toppers that I have collected over the years and all of my favorites, whether it's a denim jacket, a moto jacket, a duster length cardigan, a hip length cardigan, every one of them worked. I'm going to be running a bunch of try-ons off to the side because every time I put on a pair of boots, I thought of another outfit that I wanted to try. I think this is such a versatile trend. Now, I do want to point out that if the pointed toe is not your thing, there are also some almond toe and some round toe options. I just happen to gravitate toward this particular silhouette because I find it so leg lengthening, but you don't have to be boxed into a pointed toe. I just wanted to point that out. Here's the same boot in what they're calling white and again you can clearly see that it's more of an off-white. I found this one to be even more versatile than the cognac. I have always been drawn to cognac shoes and I kind of hesitated to pick these up but when I watched the footage back of the outfits I really liked this lighter color. I also happened to find a bag at Walmart by Time and True. This is under $20. It's kind of a messenger style and it matches these boots perfectly. I could have styled a dozen more outfits with just these two pieces, but I wanna show you more of the Western style boots. The next pair of boots that I have to share with you for this trend is the most overtly Western style out of the bunch, but I really wanted to try a pair like these. I kept seeing these all over Instagram. These are from Amazon. I noticed just yesterday that they also sell them at Kohl's. These are called the Dingo Primrose Embroidered Snip Toe Low Heel Boots. They are an Amazon's Choice item. Now these are a little bit of an investment. They're $139.99, but I want to point out that these are in fact leather, so that does make a big difference. These come in sizes 6 through 11, and they are available in 
15 colors. There are so many fun colors to choose from. I think I pretty predictably went with the neutral. If I'm going to invest, especially in a leather shoe, I want it to go with as much as possible. That's why I went neutral. But if you love pops of color, there are so many fun ones to choose from. The one that I'm sharing with you, they're calling brown. But I have to say that in person, it is much more of a champagne or a taupe. I just wanted to point that out. This fun western boot has a leather upper. It has this striking tone on tone embroidery. It has an almond toe. They're saying that it's almond, but I have to be honest, it's a little bit more pointed to my eye. And a modest, sturdy block heel. This one also has the pull tabs to pull this on and off. And I meant to mention that the ones from Walmart do not have a zipper. They are also a pull-on style. I had no difficulty getting on this pair or the ones from Walmart, but I did want to point that out. Now, I will say that this one doesn't have quite as much of a non-skid surface as the Walmart ones. I don't know about you, but when I get new shoes that do not have a non-skid sole, I will go outside on the concrete and kind of rough them up just a little bit to give them some texture. The heel itself does have a non-skid surface, so I did find that that helped. And I really wasn't sliding around on these at all, but I did want to point out that this part is smooth and then this part is textured. I think these are striking. I would love to know what you think of these, especially since they are the most expensive out of the bunch. I especially like the embroidery on these. If I'm wearing a solid colored top, it gives a little bit of visual interest love these. As you can see, I've popped into my kitchen. I'm going to switch gears for just a moment because my Green Chef box just arrived. Now, as many of you know, I am a foodie. I love to cook and I love to eat. And I am so excited to open this box and cook these delicious meals with you. I do want to thank today's sponsor, Green Chef. Green Chef is a CCOF certified organic meal kit company that helps you cook clean, delicious dinners week after week with step-by-step -step recipes and pre-measured premium ingredients. This is important to me because after a long day, I really don't want to spend a lot of time in the kitchen, so it's definitely a time saver. Something else that's important to me personally is that Green Chef offers meal kits for every lifestyle, including keto and paleo, vegan, vegetarian, fast and fit, Mediterranean, and gluten-free. And if you follow any of these special eating styles, you know that it can be a challenge to come up with new recipes. And this is where Green Chef really shines. I also love the fact that each week my Green Chef meal kit is delivered right to my door, which saves me a trip to the grocery store. Another time saver and one of my favorite parts about Green Chef is the pre-made, pre-measured sauces, dressings, and custom spice blends. Not only do these speed up the preparation time, but they add amazing restaurant quality flavor to each and every dish. This week I ordered three recipes that we're going to make together and I am really excited about all of these. The first one is steak and shrimp with creamy truffle sauce. On the card it says surf and turf is always a special occasion meal, but this combination of seared bavette steak and juicy sauteed shrimp is especially decadent thanks to a creamy truffle sauce enriched with sour cream and butter. The delicious duo pairs well with sautéed green beans and tomato, topped with delicately crunchy almonds. How amazing does this look? The smell of this when it was cooking was making my stomach rumble. I cannot wait to taste it. Mmm. This is so good. This definitely tastes like a restaurant quality meal. I'm really happy with this one. I want to show you the two other meals that I ordered. The next one I made is the chicken with lemon basil pesto. It has artichokes, cauliflower rice, with chards and dates. I love the little bit of sweetness that dates add. This one can be made in 35 minutes, so again, pretty easy. We're going to finish it up with barramundi with chipotle lime ollie. It has a kale salad with mangoes, cabbage, carrots, and almonds. This one can be made in 20 minutes. How amazing does this look? 
Green Chef now offers more variety and flexibility than ever before with double the choices. You can choose from all 24 recipes weekly with the option to mix and match meals from different preferences. So for example, maybe one meal you want keto and for another meal you want the fast and fit and now you can mix them in the same week. To get started, go to greenchef.com and use my code TeresaRenee135. This will give you $135 off across five boxes plus free shipping. And not for nothing, but this is like getting free groceries. It really is. Thanks again to Green Chef for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to the fashion. The next Western-inspired boot that I have to share with you is more on the affordable side. These are from Target. These are called the Avis Heels. They are by Universal Thread. They are $37.99. These come in a great sized range, by the way. They have sizes 5 through 12. They are available in three colors. I'm showing the cognac. They also come in a rich charcoal gray that I was really tempted by and also a versatile top. And I'll talk about that pair again in just a moment. These are an easy slip on mule styling. I love a mule. I like when I can walk in the house and just step out of my shoes without even bending over, so that's a plus. These have a solid three and a half inch block heel. They have a memory foam insole and then non-skid soles, much more so than the boots that I just shared with you actually. My favorite part about this particular style is this fun, it's almost like a puffed braid detail. It adds visual interest and texture, gives it a little something something. These have the faux suede texture and these out of all of them I have to say are one of the most padded. They have a really nice insole. I just love the silhouette of these. I think these are just perfect to wear under the very on-trend bootcut jeans. I also think that these would look really cute with a dress and maybe a little cropped denim jacket. The next pair of western inspired boots that I have to share with you are definitely a splurge but I do have a more affordable option for you. These are by the brand Dulce Vita. These are the Sita Mules. They are $140. I do want to point out that these are actual suede. These come in sizes 5 through 11. They are available in this mushroom suede. There is a deep rich black suede that I was very tempted by and then they also had a really smooth sand nubuck and that one is leather. These also have the slip-on styling. They have a luxurious suede upper. They have a comfortable 3.2 inch block heel and then a nicely padded footbed. These also have that leg lengthening pointed toe which is just my preference but again I want to point out that there are plenty of options out there if you want to do the western inspired boot trend that have either an almond toe or a round toe or even a slightly squared off toe if that's your preference. There's definitely a wide variety to choose from. I was really drawn to these. I love the color. I love the luxurious suede and I was really drawn to this braided detail. I bought these before I saw the ones from Target. I'm going to pop up a picture on the screen because this pair from Target that I just shared with you in the cognac is nearly an identical dupe for these much more expensive luxury shoes. So if you want to treat yourself to a luxe pair, I do really like these, but if you want to get the same look for a fraction of the price, you can get something very, very similar from Target for $37.99. The next pair of Western inspired boots that I have to share with you is a brand that I have worn for years, but it occurs to me that I very rarely talk about this brand on my channel. This is the brand Naturalizer. I just find the Naturalizer brand shoes in general to be so comfortable, whether it's a heel or a flat or a sandal. These are called the Soul Naturalizer Ankle Booties. These are available on Amazon. Honestly, I picked these up on a clearance rack at a department store, but I did find them on Amazon. These come in sizes 5 through 10, and they also come in regular and wide width. I'm sharing the black faux suede with you, and this is a faux suede unlike the Dulce Vita ones that I shared with you. These also come in a smooth black, 
a Krakow embossed black, which is a lot of fun, and also a Krakow embossed brown, which I was very tempted by. These that I'm showing you now are $65 in this faux suede, but the other finishes are different prices. It's just the way it is on Amazon. There's so much that I like about this particular pair. This pair, unlike the rest of the ones that I shared with you, does have a zipper, so it's even easier to put on. And not only that, but it has this whole area of stretch goring right where the ankle bone is. And I find that just like with most of my shoes from Naturalizer, they really pay attention to details like this to make them as comfortable as possible. This is a nice sturdy blocked heel. It has plenty of tread. You can probably hear that. So there's no slipping and sliding. Now this is a faux suede, as I mentioned, but it feels very similar to the actual suede on the Dulce Vita pair. I think these are really quality. I love that the faux suede is this jet inky black, much like the top that I have on. If you're curious about the top that I have on, by the way, this is from Walmart. I did feature it in a previous video. My earrings are also from Walmart. I wear these constantly, and I want to say that I paid $3.88. I still see these at my local Walmart, but if they are available online, I will link them in the description box below. But I'm totally off topic. If you want to do the Western-inspired boot, but you really need a comfortable shoe, this might be a great option for you. I would love to know if you plan on incorporating the Western style boot into your wardrobe this fall. Be sure and let me know in the comments down below. Also, let me know if you like this style video where I take a particular item and style it a bunch of different ways and show you different options. If you want to see even more affordable fashion for us ladies over 50, you're going to want to watch this video next. I share outfit inspiration, styling tips, and my take on the current trends. Thanks so much for watching and see you next time.